almost wrecked into the curb. Really? Yes. And then you almost hit a car. All right, now to another two news investigation. Doug Griffith, a repeat drunk driver who's racked up arrests in multiple states, mostly in Utah, will be sentenced on Monday. Chief investigative reporter Wendy Halloran's months long investigation bringing some resolution and also peace of mind that he's off the streets, at least for now. Wendy? Well, Heidi and Mark, I've spent months exposing the disconnect, trying to prevent Griffiths from driving and endangering lives. Here is a look back at how it got to this point, including never seen before body camera footage I obtained from his arrest in Phoenix, Arizona for aggravated DUI. It's the same MO. Over and over again. Doug Griffith was so inebriated he could barely stand up and then did push-ups trying to convince St. George police he wasn't intoxicated. Same story in Murray. Had three drinks. Holding his breath for Pocatello police officers who had to put him in a restraint device to get him to comply. After serving 10 days in the Purgatory Correctional Facility in Southern Utah, he's arrested for DUI in Utah County. He claims it's mouthwash. I mean, I did use some mouthwash tonight. It's September 20th, 2022 in Phoenix, Arizona. Dude. Hello? Hello? The officer immediately calls for a portable breathalyzer. Can you uh, see if there's a... HGN, a PBT officer available for him. He's got a large gash on his arm. How you hurt your arm? I heard it, um, I was at a strip club. What happened? Did the stripper dance too hard or what happened? No. He knows the drill and starts warming up for field sobriety testing to prove he's not inebriated, something he has done during almost every single arrest. I'm a runner. Okay. I'm a Boston runner five times. Wait a minute. What? I can't. I can't do it. Okay, if you can't do it, I don't want you to get hurt. He can hardly stand up. They stop the testing. All right, go ahead and stop. I don't want you to fall over. Nope, stop. You're going to fall, dude. Then she tries to get him to blow into the breathalyzer. You blow into a point away, I'll let you drive away. If you don't, then we'll talk. He tries to impress her. I, I have run the Boston Marathon. Feigning he doesn't know how to blow into the device, another common theme during his multiple DUI arrests. Ready? Go. Blow. 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 I was. How old are you? So, I have five beautiful grandkids. Okay, well, don't act their age. Another officer takes over. We don't even register. Go, 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 go. Dougie Fresh being placed under arrest for suspicion of driving under the influence, okay? What did I blow at, ma'am? 216. And with that, Griffith was transported and booked into the Maricopa County Jail. Five star Uber at your service. Officer Habs. Five star Uber, hop on in. I got a cold AC. What a nice damn ride it is. Yep. I'm Come on, Dougie. You I'm get totally home? Griffith is currently being prosecuted in Arizona. Meanwhile, he will be sentenced on Monday for the DUI he got in Utah County. He could face up to five years in prison. He's been locked up in the Utah County Jail since pleading guilty. Now, I also obtained recorded calls he made from jail I am continuing to go through. Mark?